one. This is Donna's happy hour. Just a reminder to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so that you get future notifications of the videos. And please leave a comment. Thank you, have a great day. coming from because it's so funny because um, <clears throat> I was fortunate enough to go to one of the few high schools that had art as a major. Yeah. Wow. So I was an art major. Cool. And I thought I was going to be doing whether it be drawing or, you know, whatever, but I also studied dance. Oh, cool. And so yeah. I danced all my life and did theater. And, my girlfriend you know, was did, a dancer for her Entire life, pretty much, up until recently. Uh, oh, yeah. oh, interesting. Yeah. What did she ballet, jazz? Uh, I think a mix, uh, a mix okay. of a lot of things. Yeah, a I know she. Things. I know she did ballet, but I think she did. She got into uh, jazz and, and uh, hip hop and all sorts of stuff. Oh, interesting. Okay. Yeah, she she taught a lot at the near, you know, last couple of years, and then she's been out of that. For yeah, a I taught. Years now. I taught for a while. My main thing was tap and jazz. That's yeah, what cool. I always did. 
And, uh, you know, it, that was, again, the same thing. You have to understand that when you go into the arts, you're probably not going to be making a lot of money in the beginning. Yeah. It, it's a tough, you know, you've got to find the con connections and find your way because you're right. It's not like, gee, I want to be a teacher. I'm going to go to school for how many years and that's There's what no I'm going to, you know, going to well, do. The other thing is nowadays, it's not like, like, it's it. I I sang. I did a song about social media tonight, right? And which is something that's a very like interesting subject. Like I'm not, I'm not, I'm more against it than I am for it. I'll tell you that uh, much. I am too. It's a necessary yes. evil for what I do. I agree. And I don't like that part of it because it, it forces me to not be a musician. It forces me to right. be an an advert an, an advertising. It forces me to be uh, my own manager. Right. It forces me, you know. But it also gives me that voice and that ability to do it. Right. So it's one of those things that you know it ha it has it has pros and cons. I, I but get it. That's part Absolutely. of the thing. You have to you have to wear all the hats. Right. Like if you're gonna do right. like if you're gonna put yourself out there as an artist or a musician or anything like that, you have to wear all the hats. Right. Now, right. You know. And, and that's not easy to do. No. You know, it is a full time job. Truthfully. Well, that's what you know. People think I play. You know, oh, <laughs> yeah. I saw you play Friday, Saturday, and Thursday. What do you do the rest of the week? It's like, dude, the rest the week I'm making posters. Right. I went to school for art design. So what do you think's making my flyers, right. my posters, oh, my advertising, wow. the booking, oh, see the, that. Wow. All, wow. all day, every yeah. day there's something going on. And, so, and I right. and I do teach on occasion. I do a couple, you know, I do wow. guitar lessons here and there just to never hurts to have extra income. You know? Right, right. <laughs> but, you but, know, that's like with the show. You know, I had been doing co-hosting for the longest time, and then I was given the opportunity. They said, "Why don't you do your own show?" And when I went home and I talked it over with my husband, he's like. Are you sure you really want to take that on? Yeah. And I, I said to him, well, you know what? If I don't try, I'll never know. That's exactly right. You know, and I am so glad that I tried because I really like doing it. I really love what I do. And it's very gratifying. I mean, there's parts of it, right, that are very gratifying Oh, there's, you, there's you know, moments, I mean, and it's like it only takes a little moment every once in a while to keep, to keep that rock going. To keep that right, to yeah, keep and that, that flame that's going. Because you yes. have, like, we did, a, we did a show in Harlem two or two, three weeks ago, um, and it was one of those nights that was just like it didn't matter what we did. The room was on fire. It was really? packed. It was, a, it, was, it was probably one of the toughest rooms in the world. I mean, it's Harlem. Right. You know, it's in yes. the middle of Harlem on a You're Saturday right. night, <laughs> and, and it's yeah. packed, and—, and, and you know, we, and we roll in there after a couple of great bands and, and they're, and we, you know, looking at us like, what are these guys going to do? You know, and we tore it up and it was just, oh, it was a great, it was just a great energy in the great room. Energy, and you, right. you leave that with this high that is unmatched. Right. Like there's just no right. better feeling because you just, you just. Yeah, it's it's beautiful. There is, there is, there is. That's like when when I was dancing, you know. And you know when you give a good performance. Yeah. And there is nothing. And whether like it's twenty it. people or twenty thousand right, people, exactly. if, if you're all on the same wavelength at right. the same time, there's right. nothing yes, like that. Yes. Yeah. 